talk about, let's talk about Pepe. Let's talk about the price of Pepe in this video, guys. Welcome back to the channel. Can Pepe go on a run? Well, we've got Elon Musk tweeting about it yesterday, which was absolutely nuts, right? So just an article out on CoinGate not too long ago here this morning, just checking in with you guys, giving you up to speed, uh, getting you up to speed on what I'm seeing and what I'm hearing out there. Pepe price analysis. Is there a bullish pattern forecasted potentially a 50% rally in Pepe coin. We're going to talk about it, guys. We had a nice run up yesterday, climbed out of the basement, if you will, on the heels of Elon Musk. And the recent correction in Pepe found the price all the way down to that 11 mark, showed a sharp bullish reversal, though, from there. The coin price nearly doubled its value less than two days and hit the uh, two level, actually. Moreover, the four-hour chart shows the formation of a famous bullish reversal pattern called the inverted head and shoulder pattern. So this is indicating a potential rise in the price of Pepe is potentially on the table here. This V recovery reflects high buying momentum in the market, indicating a possibility of a bullish recovery. The potential crossover between the 20 and 50 day EMA will accelerate the bullish pressure in the market as well. The intraday trading volume in Pepe still over a billion dollars, indicating an 18% gain. You could see some of that reversal right there on my phone. Now the head and shoulder pattern created a sharp recovery. This was right at the time that Elon Musk tweeted about Pepe as well. So right on the heels of Elon getting it out there more to the masses, it was already reversing on a technical, uh, from a technical standpoint. And with sustained buying, the coin could rise another eight to 10% today and challenge the neckline resistance uh, of this bullish rally right now, which by the way, that would get us right back up to that two level. Sorry, I was reading my phone a little bit. Um, that'll get right back up to that two level if we were to do that. So we are seeing some bullish momentum here. We are seeing buying pressure. We are seeing Elon obviously having an impact. Now, traders are looking for new longs. They could wait for a breakout and candle closing above the aforementioned trend line before they go in. So who knows? If we actually get there today, we could see more traders come in to extend that rally and potentially start pushing back to where we were heading to all-time highs, potentially where we were when Binance was listing Pepe. Now, when Binance was listing Pepe, by the way, we were sitting at about a $1.6, $1.7 billion market cap. It'll be interesting to kind of see how this plays out. Now, we did get the major pullback. I thought that was to be expected. A lot of people said, look, I told you, Pepe's done, it's over. No, I mean, listen, it was a buy the rumor, sell the news event. We're still very, very early days here with Pepe. I still think there's some good to come here with Pepe as well. I think we have to be patient a little bit, see what this market's going to do. But I think right now Pepe has the ability here to continue to sustain this rally. I think more and more people are putting eyes on it, obviously. Now Elon's talking about it, um, and it's getting out there to the masses. So we're going to keep a tab on it today. We'll see if we can get back up to that two level where we can meet some resistance. If we break through that again, that is going to be a very bullish sign that traders have come in and said, okay, we're taking long positions here at this new line of support. That will be very, very bullish for Pepe. Appreciate you guys. See you in the next video. Peace.